Stephen, I got the feeling from speaking with your players that the biggest disappointment for them tonight was that they felt that they had more to give out there. Would you go along with that? No, no. I think they gave everything they could, really. You know, I think, yeah, you know, we're still in pre-season for the players. It's still the pre-season. I think um, overall we're disappointed to lose the game. You want to win the game, of course. My first home game, of course, we want to win it. Um, but, you know, we've been experimental in the two games. I think the big picture for, for me and for the coaching staff is the game against Slovakia. You know, I think we wanted to learn a lot in the two games in relation to, you know, who was in form and who, who would do well in relation to selection for the, for the game against Slovakia. We've been a bit experimental. Um, you know, I think uh, some players have done very well. I think when you look at the games overall, they've all been 1-0 or one all. Wales, injury time winner against Bulgaria, 80-odd minute against Finland. We, we got a late equaliser in Bulgaria. We got done 1-0 here. We probably missed five really good chances today. So you have to take your chances at this level. In those tight games, there's not that many get chances creating a lot of those tight games. So with four or five really good chances today, and we just uh, didn't take them. And that's the harsh reality. And, you know, we, we have to accept that. What's the mood like in the dressing room at the minute? What's the overriding emotion? Is it frustration, well, disappointment? The game's not long over, you know. I think... Uh, Realistically, of course, people are disappointed, but I don't think we'd be. I don't think this is important in its own right to win games and to win every international game is important, and we don't want to deflect from that. Um, and we're disappointed to lose, but the big picture for, for us definitely was preparing for Slovakia. I think some players today, over the two games, did very well. Some players did better than others, and uh, some players did very well. and and uh, give us real, real feel for talk with, with relation to, you know, the big playoff game against Slovakia and, and Bosnia and Northern Ireland over the, over the, over the next two months, depending on how we, how we do in Slovakia. So our ambition is to be really ready, you know, and uh, when we go to Slovakia, the players will have played a month in their league season. They haven't even kicked off. The leagues we've been playing against, Bulgaria and Finland are, are you know, have, are in further into their season. I think the players. I think a lot of our players, um, you know, we probably could have done <laughs> making a couple of changes in midfield. Fellas were out, ran out of steam here, but you know that wasn't possible. And I think, uh, uh, but everyone gave everything. The attitude of the players was absolutely excellent, brilliant. Just didn't take the chances that we had, and uh, we'd be looking at a different complexion otherwise. It's clear from speaking with the players. It's clear from speaking with the players that they've all really bought into your philosophy and your style of play. How would you sum up your first week in charge with the players here as a group? Well, we wanted to make it clear what we wanted to play. And, and uh, we've only had, as you say, <laughs> four days training, really, so overall. so. Uh, but obviously the, res the results, you want the results to be better in the Nations League, even though we were blood and players. We get three players got their first start in Ireland tonight. Jason Malumbi, Aaron Connolly and Adam Ida. They're important players for Ireland in the future. I think they've all shown promise. I think, um, you know, uh, we're, we're disappointed to lose today. You know, it's, uh, but we, we have to realise um, that there was a lot of good points to come from today. And uh, some good, some players did quite well. And, uh, so we've 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 a lot to think about for next month. Thanks for talking to you, Stephen. Thank you.